Okay, so we're going to go with some uh, investing one lump sum, and we're going to unpack the question a little bit. Um, so let's have a little look. Question five here. The clue is I've got the compound interest formula down here. So let's see what we've got. Uh, feature invests UK 400. So PV equals 400. Um, the interest rate is R equals 4% per annum compounded monthly. So K equals 12. And part A is calculate how much money he has. So that's the final value we're after. So the final value is present value into 1 plus R over 100 times K. And that's K. And then the number of years for part A is 10. Okay, and so when we switch that out into the TI Inspire, let's just dock, make sure in, oh, that's uh, my bad, it's dock, let's insert a calculator page, make sure we've got the right one on there, and then just type in exactly what you see, 400 times by open bracket, 1 plus open fraction, okay, 4, divided by 100 times 12 and then powered up to 12 times 10. You can obviously calculate these little bits individually and look at that, it gives you an exact answer. That's amazing, isn't it? Now remember we press enter and it gives an exact answer. We can actually just go up again, bring this down and press control enter and it gives you the decimal answer. So we can go back here and say the final value here is equal to 596.33 and that will be GB pounds. Okay, so calculate how long it takes for his money to double. So we're going to go back to the original question. Let's just do part B here. And calculate how long it takes for his money to double. So we'll go back to present value of 400 so the final value will be 800 so 800 equals 400 into 1 plus 4 over 100 times 12 and this is k times by n so exactly the same equation but now we've got an unknown to solve for so this is a um, prime candidate for finance solver and so let, let's try finance solver see if that will do the business menu algebra sorry not finance solver numerical solve we'll try finance solver uh, in a moment so we type in the exact equation 800 equals to 400 times by open bracket 1 plus fraction 4 over 100 times 12 all powered up to 12 times n. Fabulous. Click. We want to solve that equation, comma, with respect to variable n. Close the bracket and press go. Okay, and this is going to happen quite often actually, that um, we've maybe put too many brackets in there and it looks a bit of a mess here. So let's just have a little look. We've got a few too many brackets in the start here. Let's take out the start in bracket. Let's take out the end bracket. And let's have a look. We're solving 800 equals 400 times. There we see it. OK, so that looks a little bit better now. OK, and so it's 1 plus 4 over 100 times 12, which is in a bracket, all to the power of 12n. And there we've got n. So here we've got a value for n. Now remember, n represents in the formula the number of years. Okay. So here we've got n is equal to 17.4 years, and that's to three significant figures. 